Hello everyone. I honestly hope you guys are having a great day. I am just going to get into it on our second question that we got on Ask Princess Passive Income. <laughs> Someone said, what would I do with $6,000 in the bank? So what I'm guessing is this person has $6,000 in the bank just sitting there and they want to make their money work for them. And I think that's absolutely fantastic because a lot of people don't have any money in the bank honestly people don't save money like and we need to start saving money guys I'm gonna we're gonna have to talk about this I know a lot of people are don't want to hear about saving money but saving money is very important and we must save 10% of our income we'll talk about that another time though so what I would do especially now guys we are literally at the perfect moment in the stock market. Many stocks lost between 20 to 50%. When people are afraid and they sell, you do the opposite of the herd. Successful people do the opposite of what everyone else is doing. That's why they have the 1%. The 1% does things differently than the 99%. That's why they're the 1%. So there's companies that got hit very hard because of the coronavirus. And not only that, we're at the trade war with China and just a lot of stuff going on in the economy and QE4, which is quantitative easement for, which they just pump trillions of dollars in the economy, which makes the value of the dollar go down. That's where inflation happens. And that's why like that once upon a time Kit Kat bar that was 50 cents is now $1.25 and pay pretty much stays the same for the most part. Like it doesn't match inflation. But anyway, what I would do with that $6,000 is I would invest it in the stock market. But the question is when to invest in the stock market. And that answer is it's almost now, ladies and gentlemen. Because so many stocks have lost so much. For example, airlines, because of the coronavirus, got hit the hardest. Airlines and cruise lines. So Delta, I'm about to give y'all some stock tips. Let me tell y'all where I'm investing. Let's talk about it real quick. So... I'm waiting, I'm doing my little technical analysis, and I'm going to invest in airline companies. I'm looking at Azul Airlines, I'm looking at Delta Airlines, I'm also looking at Southwest, and I'm also looking at Norwegian Cruise Line, because those four companies took a major, 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 major hit for the coronavirus, but... That doesn't mean people are going to stop flying. Like once, hello, we go through this every two years. It's the SARS one year. They remember the swine flu two years before that. They remember, like, it seems like every two years, there's a new epidemic. They remember, what was the last? Okay, the last one was Ebola. Remember that one? So it's like every two years, the government makes up a virus and tries to kill people. But population control is real. Definitely look that one up. But anyways, we're here to talk about stocks. Now, the thing is, let's just say, because you know everybody, Louis Vuitton, Gucci, whatever, goes on a 50% off sale, you will probably run up in that store and buy as much as you can. Now, that's the same thing with stocks. I will be investing very heavily in Delta Airlines very soon, like in the next couple days. I'm just waiting to see if this is the beginning of the recession yet. So that's why I'm sitting patiently waiting to see. But if this is just like a down, back up, a correction, excuse me, yeah, if this is just a correction, I will be vet investing very heavily into Delta Airlines and possibly New Region cruise line but definitely delta airways so ladies and gentlemen you want to invest in stocks when everyone's selling you understand i used to back in the day 
follow the herd and do what everyone else is doing until I started studying billionaires. Like I started studying how Warren Buffett actually trades. I started studying how Manish Prabhai trades. I started studying how Phil Town trades. These are billionaires, like billion with a B. And they trade completely, completely different. They wait until there's blood in the water. And that's when they do their trading. So I have been out the market waiting patiently for this correction. And as you guys know, for those who do follow the stock market, the Dow Jones has went down. And this is a blessing for me. So I hope this is a blessing for you. So as the question goes, what would I do with $6,000? I would invest it in the stock market, but only invest it in blue chip companies that pay a dividend. Because you, you want to make sure that passive income, like that's what it's all about, that passive income. And pretty much what a dividend is, is companies who have like art established like Johnson & Johnson and Procter and & Gamble and you know, companies like that that have been around forever, what they do is they divvy up some of their profits every quarter to investors. So look for dividend paying stocks, blue chip companies that have had a major plummet because that stock, ladies and gentlemen, is technically on sale. So that's the answer to the question. If you have any comments or have any questions, just comment them or DM me. And I look forward to hearing from you. Take care and have an absolutely fantastic day. Namaste.